Hello and welcome to an episode of Ta Tiger Woods PGA Tour 2005, the PGA Tour season. It's time to finish the True North Classic. We've already won it. It's easy enough. 69, nice. Got me that joke again, because why not? Let's do this. Welcome to the desert. The True North Monument Course in Scottsdale, Arizona is target golf at its best. Hello again, everybody. I'm Gary McCord for EA Sports. My colleague David Faraday is ready to call the action today, so let's send it down to the first tee. Welcome to the final round of this PGA Tour event at the Monument Course at True North. All right, then, same as always for True North. We need accuracy, so we're going to play the three wood. Oh, 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 I saw the wind then. I saw the wind. I'm going to aim over here. And the wind will take it to the, to the right. There we are. Okay, should be in good position. Could have ended up in the rough there if I wasn't careful, but I backed out the swing in time. We get a decent fairway shot. Wind's quite strong, so if I aim over here, this should slowly glide towards the hole. Okay, the wind didn't really do much there, to be honest, but it is what it is. This might be a Tiger Vision. This is a tough green. I take I take that all back. It's straight and easy enough. Look at that birdie. Nicely done. So I've got three forty nines, but I do think a forty eight is possible, like quite easily, because we keep birding a par five rather than getting an eagle. So if you get eagle on both, you get forty eight. The last aim is to get forty eight, but it isn't the easiest thing in the world, and the wind's strong again. This might over hit a bit. But we can backspin it. Hit this one well. no, Ooh. I should have some forward spin on that. Should be able to make birdie here. Could have got a hole in one with the, with the right spin there. It would have been tough because you need a lot of spin in that situation. That's your birdie. But it's an easy birdie. It's a one put. Can't complain. Yeah, the AI getting some really good scores this time. I wonder if it does rubber band based on your performance, but this par five is we've kind of played so well, we've kind of capped it out or something. Right. No, I can't have it. In 03, in 03, it, it's the hard, the harder, the harder tournaments give you, give them 15 under par per per round. So I'm guessing it's going to be something similar to this one. This is. David Ferdy. Okay. Simple. This is a par five. 190 yards left the hole. Here it is, right. We want the eagle. Oh. I'm gonna power boost this. Compensate for the wind. This might overhit a little bit because it's this it's downhill. Right That's just incredible. We can do that. We get the close approach. Five feet normally isn't a close approach, but it's only just five feet. It's an easy eagle. So far, a calm and collective performance. I think the seals will get better once I start having to put on different courses per tournament, to be honest. Because once you get to round four of the same course, like, you know exactly what I'm going to do. My strategy is already set. I don't have to think about it as much, because I'm just doing what I did last time, for the most part. Oh god, no. That hey, wind. David, just you and I sit back Stay and away from the bunker. This is a pit shot, right. It can clear. It's got to clear that bunker. Great shot. He's got to be pleased by there we are. Clear the bunker easily, and if he can do that, it's going to get close. Looking at a big birdie putt here. And it's another simple putt. Here we are. Sinks the birdie putt. What happened to Tiger Woods anyway? Where was he? Oh, he's sixth. Yeah, safe to say we've won. <laughs> it's just all about getting some good stats now. Five for those trophy balls. Par four with right, par four. Okay. Yeah, this we can just blast. Even though I, I messed up the power boost. I messed up the power boost, but it'll be fine. Uh, 
Okay, this will be a bit to the right because of the wind. I didn't really compensate for that too much. But we can spin it. Yeah, it could have been better. I could have compensated for the wind a bit better. But other than that... I'm going to take the risk here. I'm not Tiger Vision this. I should get this in. I mean, it's not exactly hard. But I have blown easy putts before, and like I said, like every video you want the best, the, you want the lowest putts per green, possible putts per hole possible, to give you more leeway later on. I mean, to be fair, I think even the fantasy courses we could do 1.3 on better, which is what the trophy ball is. But come on, let's see if that weird training. You obviously want to uh, go for the green. Do as good as possible, really. Right. Gonna avoid the power boost. Ooh, this is looking good. Oh no. I wasn't sure how much the elevation would come into play there, but it came into play enough. And it hits the green. And leaves us with an easy putt. I wasn't sure that I had enough power on that for a second, but it's in. So far so good. One put every hole, every green regulation, uh, every fairway hit so far. The problem is, if I did this for 04, the problem is I'm pretty sure the stats are bugged. So you keep saying that I missed a fairway half the time, and I know I don't. But an 04, it, oh. I'm gonna hit a four iron. Yeah, that'll do, that'll do. Only just, only just, but it's within a feet, within a foot. This would be seven straight birdies. I thought that was going to bounce backwards then, but it just bounced forwards. Playing with fire a bit there, but we get what we want, and that's all that matters in the end of the day. The eighth hole is a par four that rewards strong tee shots. Right, par four, this one we can just carry the bunker, can't we? Yeah, we can. It'll blow to the right of it because of the wind, but... This is what you call getting all of it. It just means we have to hit over the bunker, which is going to be easy enough, but close enough anyway. I think I flop shot, to be honest. He's right on target with this shot. Hit it on the green. This would be easy to clear the bunker. Eight straight birdies. Easy enough, but... Easy enough, but there we are. I mean, it's easy enough, but you can mess them up. To be fair, if you get if you get it a little wrong, but keep our calm, keep our cool. Is a straightaway par five with a oh, we put the birdie, and now here's another time to absolutely unleash this power that we have. It's gonna to blow to the right quite a bit because it's uh, off it off the tee. He blasted it. That's gonna take it straight down the middle. Here's your twenty nine yards. Could have been longer, to be fair. Over two hundred yards here, wouldn't you say, David? You know your stuff. You're a Didn't quite get all the power boost I wanted, but it will do. Well, that's played a little short because of the elevation. Here's a good one. But we can spin it. Don't want to play a two iron because I thought that would overhit. Good position here to drop this one for Eagle on the par five. Okay, once again, we can put this. This isn't too bad. That's his third. I was away for a second. That was too far on the left side, but it's in. Eight one under par. Sing on a good game. At Twenty eight under par. He's got second, but it will take the biggest collapse in history. I wouldn't be surprised if we could if we could forfeit every hole and still bloody win this tournament now. Maybe not. I wish I could hit the ball this far. Right, where the hole is, we can't. We can't get an eagle here. 
Well, to be fair, we could actually, if we get this right. It's going to advance to, 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 to the last a bit. Okay, that carried it all the way. I wasn't, I wasn't expecting that. This attempt for a tenth. Oh, it's aggravation in that. Jesus Christ. Tough green, tough green. Oh yeah. I mean, we have spare tiger vision, so we're going to use it now. We didn't use a single one through the, through, through the first nine, so the back nine we have all four. And that's one of the tougher putts we're going to get. Hole eleven is a long par five that dog legs right. Right, the par five. This is the one. Is this the one that we tend to not eagle? No, it's not. It's the next one. There's one more after this. For a second, I thought I was in that, that you know tree, that little tree in front of me. But we get, get over it. It's fine. This isn't a piece of cake from here, is it? Dave? No, it isn't. About 190 yards left of the hole. Right, we'll aim straight for the hole. Bit of power boost. This will play short. Nice swing. This is looking very. Oh, he's pleased. This won't play short at all. Jesus Christ. Well, this one had a real chance of going in the hole. Power boost. Uh, Left turn on this one. Very much compensating for the wind there. Thought the uh, elevation plus the wind would be enough to like keep it a bit short, but we got it, and he needs an eagle. Smooth sailing still. The twelfth hole is a par four that bends. Right, this is the one with that in the bunker light. Going all the way through the middle of the course and we can't overhit it. It's 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 uphill, so not a chance. So we'll just play a three wood, play it short. Good ball here, David. This should work out great. David, I'm gonna take the second shot. Simple enough. 110 yards the flag. A sand wedge might play too short. We'll play a pitch and wedge, but take a bit of power out of it. And it's worked out completely. It's worked out exactly as we hoped. Even even Leverkusen's impressed with himself. He's in shock. The sandwich tends to play shorter than what it says on the on the on the map. So I didn't take the risk that it, it, it was actually get there. Took the pitching wedge. Took, took a bit of power out, and we got it pretty much bang on. What's Hole next? Is a straightforward par three. The green right, under the par three. I won't call the holding one again. I won't call the ace. Last time I did that, I was miles off. Go on. Oh, come on, game. What's that? I won't call it, but actually get it anyway. And then we're in, oh. seventeen under. Inches off a holding one. We need them as well. I need them. I need like a good 13 or 14 more for the bloody trophy balls. I was kind of hoping I'd get them all in season mode, but I might have to kind of cheese it and just play a bunch of par threes off camera. The 14th hole is another monster par five. That do I mean, I want the. Uh, this is the one which I should go to Eagle. I want to either need to get the last like two, because you need like 19 for Tracking Tiger and 20 for Tracking Legends. I want to get those two on camera at least. We didn't get a lot of power boost there. This what might this might be tough to, to get there. The wind's forward, forward though, isn't it? Yeah, it is. Right, the wind's going to help here. Get as much forward spin as possible. Not a terrible shot. But on the green, a tiger vision will likely be required, but we can get the eagle here, this unless the puts in that suit and wants to. Oh, that's straight. That's going to be straight. That's the easy. That's one of the easiest thirty-two foot putts you can get. Just whack it. Hopefully, not too much power. This looks pretty good. There we are. For a second, I thought it was going to be a bit too far to the right, and it kind of lied to me. But it's in. We get the eagle, and I think we might be on course for forty-eight. So I don't think that, that, that dodgy par four. That I tried to get there in one. I don't think I've eagled that yet. Hole 15 is a straightaway par. F oh, I think this one I do watch the eagle. Oh, 
get as much Fantastic kind of less spin as possible here. It's nice. Ooh, an absolutely perfect shot. The danger is you aim too close to the hole off your tee, you might end up in the bunker. Whereas if you can just spin, you know, aim to the right and spin it towards the left. This would be a rare feat. You get a tougher putt, but you get the safer shot. We'll take a vision this one instead. About that. This looks good. Hey, yeah, 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 there we go. See what? Right? Dead on. There's center with the target vision. It misses. The target vision tends to be a little off for the tougher parts. You have to, you have to adjust for that. And we, we, we are on course for 48 because if we get a two, three, and a three, that, that's obviously eight. End up with a 48. The Quick maths. Is a short par three with a that last time. And I got the double eagle. And barely celebrated because I was doing doing maths. I am British, so it's maths and not math. Pitch and wedge for the win. This will get relatively close. He's got this going right at uh, him. What a shot, David. The right spin could have got that in. Because the, uh, the, the, fl the flag would have stopped. Stop the ball from just you know going over the hole, but Found the hole for a nice off over it. He knows it. Yeah, we could forfeit the last two holes and still win either, but we're not going to do that. We want the forty-eight. Hole seventeen is straight away. So the last two par fours are medium length, so you can't really do much here. You just got to play it normal. But we need the power though because the wind's backwards, so we can do with the power here. Bit of power was to compensate for the wind. Air traffic control. We're headed for the flag. Oh, I didn't see where it was going until too late. But I think we've got two target visions anyway, so it doesn't really matter. Not that we need it. <laughs> Should just be a tapping, really. Bravo! It's a well played birdie. One more hole to go. All we need is the birdie for our best performance. 349 is in a 48. Absolutely killed this course. The finishing hole Compared to the AI anyway. I don't know what like, if there's any like, you know, online leaderboard stuff like that. I'm that I'm that high, but compared to what I need, I've done I've done I've done my job. That's all that matters here. Alright, sandwich. We'll play it a little, oh, the wind though. Okay, I think the wind won't compensate for, for the sand wedges kind of lack of power. Good. Really good. That's close to the hole, I think it's over hit a bit. It's not, it's actually under it. When you hit with the wedge, the problem is the camera angle's so high you can't see the flag or where it's going to land, so sometimes the spin's hard to, hard, hard to, hard to uh, you know, judge. What a performance. Congratulations on your tournament win. But we've won another tournament, we're two in a row. True North Classic. I think that costs a rookie of the month just already now, there's only one left. Problem is, you can only get rookie of the month once. Because obviously you're only going to get a rookie once. So if you don't get all of them, you can't complete the trophy room. And that's what I'm trying to do here. But if I just win everything, if I just win everything, I should, get, I should always get it right. That's my theory. It makes sense. So next up it is the Harbour Town Invitational. Obviously at Harbour Town. All four rounds again. And then I think the Western Challenge is when they start to change the courses. But for now, thank you very much for watching. And I will see you next time for some Let's Play Tag Wars PGA Tour 2005, the PGA Tour season.